smartphones and VR headsets. It's fully solar powered. Uh, it's staffed at all times with a, a couple of trainers as well. Um, we didn't create the concept. Uh, there's a charity partner who worked with Close the Gap from Belgium, and they have actually supported five other trucks across Africa with other partners before. And each country, they've got different local partners who are operating the truck uh, with the trainers on the truck as well. Um, the idea is different in every country, but we try to develop something that's sustainable. So, for example, if we're going to do teacher training programs, we work with schools where they've already got computers. There's no point teaching teachers if the schools don't have computers that they use. Um, and we recognize in many schools they may have computers, but they actually haven't got the skills to use them well, or to integrate digital curriculum um, well, or to even teach the students how to use computers. So that's the kind of programs we do for the teacher training side. Uh, the laptops is really for young people or elderly people, but are more around online work. Uh, and that's something that takes like maybe 30, 40 hours worth of training. How to use Excel, PowerPoint, Internet Explorer, Wikipedia, Coursera, some of these things to study online and to get jobs online uh, or to earn money online or do e commerce and so on. And the third aspect is around smartphone training. There's a much shorter program, just two or three hours together with GSMA uh, and that's really about the basics of using a smartphone, uh, using Google functions, using Facebook.